Oh, Bill, Bill, I have to say this. Every time you talk about your 15-year-old, I feel terrible. I feel terrible that he has to live in a city like this, and a young man like your son would have to go through the potential of being stopped in prison and being instructed by his dad what to do if, you would have, if he has some kind of trouble. Bill, I want you to join me, because I feel lonely. <laughs> And I appreciate your comment. At the same point, no, I'm the one who has to worry about my son being stopped first. I'm the one who has to worry about my son being shot in the street of New York. I'm the one who has to worry because when I grew up, it was a very different situation. I'm concerned about my son also being shot by somebody who's a member of a gang in the street. I'm worried about my son being mugged in the street of New York City. And at the same point, I don't have to sacrifice his constitutional rights to make sure he is safe. I don't have to sacrifice, I can have them both. So the truth is, you know something? You and I disagree on that. Fundamentally, we have a disagreement at the same point. We both want to see things used and done correctly in the city of New York. Okay. That is the thing okay. between the two of us. We agree. I got, I got, I want to thank